Hey guys, this is Hype again. Welcome to a brand new video on Hype Gaming. On this video, we are going to talk about top 5 best Android emulators for gaming and obviously run apps. Android is a powerful OS offering a complete package for a smartphone along with the possibilities of in-depth access to your mobile device. You can install third-party apps, change UI, tweak the look and feel of the phone by means of good customization offered by the Android OS. So hold tight guys, cause we are going to start this video. But before starting, I would request you to subscribe Happy Gaming and if you have subscribed us then thanks a lot. So now let's dig in. Number 5. Remix OS Remix OS Player by Z is one of the newer Android emulators for PC. It runs Android Marshmallow and that's still relatively new compared to many of the others on the list. The installation process is pretty simple and using it also fairly easy. It caters mostly to gamers. There are a few games with specific features along with the customizable toolbar. It boasts features like running multiple games at once. That said, it's fairly clean emulator so it's still perfectly usable as a productivity tool. The site seems to be down for a time being. And the lack of updates likely means this one is ongoing get old very quickly. Still you can download it on 4 sub if you really want to try it out. Number 4. Nox App Player Nox is another Android for PC for gamers that includes the usual stuff like key mapping with your keyboard, actual controller support and even the ability to key map just the controls. For instance, you can assign the function to swipe right to an arrow key and use that in the game without actual hardware controller support. It's a lot fun and seems to work rather well most of the time. It's also entirely free and in active development. Also you can specify the CPU and RAM uses in the settings option to get the best gaming results. If rooting Android is your focus, Nostalgia makes it easy to the root virtual device under one minute. The only problem with Nox is that it puts a lot of load on the system. Number 3. LD Player LD Player is an emulator designed for playing mobile games on Windows. Play games with keyboard and mouse. The simulator lets you operate simply and conveniently even in multiplayer games. LD Player is compatible with various types of games offering smooth control, stable and efficient operations. You can run multiple games at a time without any process skill, based on Android Lollipop. In addition to playing Android games on PC, you can also access Google Play Store along with Google Mobile Services Suite for other apps. With its multiple functional design and user-friendly settings, it is one of the most recommended simulators for PC. This simulator is also known for playing PUBG Mobile on a low-end PC. Number 2. Memo Memo is another of the up-and-coming Android emulators that seems to do quite well with gamers. One of its biggest features is support for both AMD and Intel chipsets. Most work on AMD processors, but it's nice to see developers especially pay attention to AMD platforms, as AMD 3rd gen and Navi is very popular right now. Additionally, it supports Android Jelly Bean, KitKat and Lollipop. You can even run multiple instances at once for multiple games or testing features. It aims itself at gamers, much like BlueStacks and similar emulators. However, it's also quite usable as a productivity tool as well. This is a very popular and good emulator with the regular updates. We appreciate that. Number 1. BlueStacks BlueStacks is most mainstream of all Android emulators. There are several reasons for that. For starters, it's compatible with Windows and Mac. It was also one of the fast and worked really well that still gets regular updates. The emulator targets mobile gamers. There is a stigma with BlueStacks because it can feel a little bloated at times. BlueStacks 4 aim to fix that with mixed results. It also includes key mapping and settings for many games installed. That should help make things much easier. It's one of the heaviest stimulators on the list. However, it also has the most features for better or for lowers. Recent updates put BlueStacks at Android 7.1.2 Nougat, one of the most recent of any emulator. The update of BlueStacks 4 also improved its speed even on older computers. So I hope that guys you have liked this video. If you like this video, like, share, subscribe and comment down below. And obviously, don't forget to subscribe and if you have to say us something, just comment, cause we read every comment very carefully. So see you soon in the next video, till then stay safe, be happy, this is Hyper, signing off, goodbye and have a good day.